Now welcome to another video. We are given x to the power 3 minus x to the power 0 equals to 26. All right. Now solution. Now x cube minus x to the power 0 equals to 26. Now before we start, any non zero number to the power 0 is 1. So, my next step will be s key minus 1 equals to 26. Okay. Now, we can add 1 to both sides. So, s key minus 1, okay, plus 1 equals to 26 plus 1. This side will go. I will s key equals to 27 okay now if you decide to take cubes on both sides it will limit the solution now x to the power 3 here x is supposed to you know get three solutions so we need to solve for all the solutions here so from here i can say that s cube minus 27 is equal to 0 so s cube minus 27 is equal to 0 now let's understand the difference and sum of cubes now when we have s cube plus a cube the same as x plus a then we have x squared minus ax plus a squared. So this one is called sum of cubes. Now when we have s cube minus a cube. So we have difference. So we have x minus a. And we have x squared plus ax plus a squared this one is difference difference of tips okay so knowing the difference and sum so the difference this side is minus and the sum this side is plus and once this side is plus this side becomes negative and this side is minus this side becomes plus so let's go ahead and write s cube minus 27 as difference of cubes. So s cube minus, so we have 3 to the power 3. And it will be x minus 3. Then we have x squared plus the product of 2, 3x plus 3 squared, that is 9, equal to 0. Now with the zero product x minus three equal to zero and then we have x squared plus three x plus nine equal to zero. So the first solution x minus three is equal to zero, x equals to three. So we need to find the other two solutions. So x squared x squared plus 3x plus 9 equal to 0. Now let's compare this one with the general quadratic equation. ax squared plus bx plus c equal to zero so we have a as one b as three then c as nine so with this we can go ahead with the almighty formula b squared minus four ac on two a okay so 
this side will be minus 3 plus or minus so we have b squared that is 3 squared 9 minus 4 times 1 times 9 on 2 times 1 that will be minus 3 plus or minus so we have 9 minus 36 on 2 so that will be so x equals to minus 3 minus 3 plus or minus so 9 that will be minus 27 So minus 27 or 2. Okay. Now because of the negative, okay. Don't forget that. Square root of minus 1 is the same as i. Okay. And minus 1 is the same as i squared from complex numbers. Okay. Now, from here, you can write this one as minus 3 plus or minus negative 1 times 27 and 2. So my x will be minus 3 plus or minus negative 1 times 27. So my x will be minus 3 plus or minus. So this one becomes i times. Now we have 9, 3, 27. Okay. Minus 3 plus or minus. So we have 9 times 3 on 2. So my x will be minus 3 plus or minus. So this one is a perfect square. That will be 3. So 3i and 3. Sorry, let me put the i here. 3 will 3i three on 2. So the first answer that will be x squared will be minus 3 plus of minus. Sorry, plus 3 will 3i three on 2. And the third solution will be minus 3 minus 3 will 3i. Three on two okay don't forget that x1 is three this is two x3 all right so thanks for watching